Hello, this is Kate again. Dutch and I really like cooking and we like spending time in the dining area. So kitchen and dining area is a very important place for us. We've done multiple meetings with different kitchen suppliers. We've been to Bulltop, Pock and Pole, Simeti, and a few other more suppliers. And all of them had great quality, a very modern and sleek look. Let's look at Bulltop showroom in Thailand, which is located right next to Minoti showroom. It is a high quality German kitchen manufacturer. They have B1, B2, B3 models where B1 focuses on the essentials, B2 focuses more on the kitchen like workshop concept, and B3 provides various options and um, freedom of configuration. During initial kitchen meeting, we shared our budget the dimension for our kitchen area and then the important features that we care about. In general, we talk about everything, what we like for the kitchen to be like. And after a few days, the suppliers came out with a draft. We are going through the details and trying to decide which kitchen we should go for. While doing kitchen meeting, I was so surprised. There are various options that we can choose, not just related to the features, but for customization and optimization, there are so many things to look into and choose one by one. At this point, we are mainly doing the research, so it won't cover all the details, but um, I just want to show you a few options that we really like at Bulltop. Okay, but we have a budget and we need to be careful what to choose and what not to choose, but everything seriously looks so good. Uh, this is one of their coffee corner ideas which looks like a coffee corner inside the cabinet. Uh, the cabinet door opens and closes very smoothly. It has automatic light on when you open it. Even if you put it in the middle like this, it looks pretty neat. This is a uh, seasoning and spices storage, which is part of B3 project. I really like this unit. It looks so pretty and neat. Mm -hmm. But practically speaking, I don't think I would use it that much. Bulltop design in general looks very neat and clean. It doesn't look bulky. It's pretty delicate. Finishing is really good and opening and closing feeling is very smooth. Bulltop B3 project is well known for their multifunction wall and their shelf organizations. You can all these small dividers and uh, different units to create your own shelf design. Their creations seem very well thought through, good quality, but also pricey. It's not easy to choose few out of them. Here we see drawer fridge, which also looks pretty handy to use. It'll be great to host people. They can just open and like take out any drinks that they want without having to go through someone else's fridge. And yes, of course, the opening and closing are pretty smooth. These are just few options that we like so far. Later on, we will do more detailed review on the products once everything is selected. It's time for us to update on our new home renovation. It's Songkran over here, which is a Thai New Year holiday. I'm sure you will know, but it's like a big festival in Thailand. But because of COVID situation, um, this year everything is pretty quiet. But still, it's holiday season, so this whole week nobody is working. The progress is pretty slow. We managed to remove the wall. The system and the piping on the ceiling has to be removed yet. The next step will be uh, building the wall and we have a meeting planned for the flooring. These were originally built in the kitchen from the previous um, owner. I think they were trying to renovate it and rent it out and then decided to just sell the unit. A small fridge and uh, these are some cabinets and we're just discussing if we were going to keep it or give it to somebody. It will take almost like four months for the whole construction to be finalized. In Korea, that's like pretty long period to do renovation. But I just heard from my interior designers that in Thailand, it takes a little bit longer than 
how it is compared to Korea because everything has to be done manually like the the woodwork um, all the crafts has to be done one by one and also I noticed because we are renovating a unit in condo there is a uh, restrictions in working hours so per day there's only like limited hours that they can work Right now we're still at the research stage so I think the videos will cover like what to look out for when you do research for this or that but in the end we will do a lot of reviews for the products we like and what we chose and also like small small interior items as well so it will be interesting going forward so please subscribe like and turn on your notifications 구독, 좋아요, 알림 설정 잊지 마시고요 and please please leave some comments for us Anything that's related to our channel, if you leave some comments, we will do some research and share the information with you. Thank you. Bye-bye.